European uh, reed warblers are famous for their migration from Europe down to Africa every year. And we've always been amazed at the ability for birds to be able to locate themselves on migration. We've known for a long time that European reed warblers will fly 600 metres in the air and 7,000 kilometres on their migration. We also know that if you band them in a location like this in a reed bed in Europe, the following year you can catch the same bird in the same location. How is it that the bird finds its way back so precisely to the same locations every year. Now there's all sorts of theories that have been put together about migration and we're starting to understand it more and more. Clearly birds use landmarks, clearly use stars at night, but one of the things that we've always suspected is that they use the Earth's magnetic uh, field. And this is a, this has um, been understood, but we haven't quite understood how that has happened. And in some recent research on the European reed warbler, We've discovered it's the angle of inclination that they can get off the magnetic field that gives them the orientation so precisely and can get them back to specific locations. So this way of interpreting the magnetic field within their bodies is a real clue as to how birds can find these locations. How the mechanism works and working out how they use it in detail is still a matter for much more research. But we are learning more about these amazing abilities of birds and how they can find their ways across, right across the globe and back to locations within a few metres of where they left a, a year earlier.